All right, Lords of the Fallen. Let's have a look. On behalf oh! of Hexworks, welcome to the Lords that a little dodge. Of the gameplay showcase. Today, we're taking a closer look at our old new My boys having technicals, but RPG, he's still here. Arriving this October on PC, PS5, and Xbox Series X and S. So this is straight next gen. Spiritual successor to the original 2014 release, it acts as a full reboot for the franchise, taking place in a vast, interconnected world. Okay. A thousand years later, featuring colossal boss battles, fast, challenging combat. And fast combat, he said. storytelling. He said fast, challenging combat. Across two parallel realms in this expansive RPG experience. The world of the living, Axiom, and the, the world, world of, of the, the dead, dead, Umbral, with each featuring its own unique pathways, characters, enemies, and, of course, treasures. I like this, but I'm just hoping Axiom there isn't that soul's jank. Challenges. Untold horrors await. No, nah, this is a bit more action combat. RPG. I'm hoping so. Thanks to the Umbral Lamp, players can enter this lightless world at any time in one of two ways. When slain by the foes of Axiom, at which point uh, yeah. they resurrect in the same okay. location, albeit in Umbral. Or by performing the Umbral Rift and willingly sacrificing one of your two lives. Oh! Holds yet more Man have to die to go to the world, world of the dead. Basically, it makes sense. From an enemy for some high damage attacks. Fish! Must have take the soul. Manipulate the very environment of the Umbral world. Yo, Chris, I told you, yo. bro. You spend in this wraith-ridden plane the greater number of Chris, I told you, my guy. That will hunt you down. I told you, pimp. Mm -hmm. But as harrowing as the Hellions of Umbral are, they pale in comparison to the game's brutal boss battles. Let's have a look. Let's see what they're trying to do with this boss team. city of Kalrath, this gargantuan monstrosity doesn't take kindly to would-be adventurers. The demonic presence within. Ready to devour the man have a, a, a hand that come out of his mouth. I hear it. A merciless torturer prepared to carry out any atrocity in the name of his faith. Tancred, master of castigation. It's got a little dodge there. A little, a little skip dodge. Beneath the pious veil, his very own flesh. I kind of like that. I kind of like that skip dodge. I kind of like it. So that skip dodge. And graphically, it's not too bad. It's, it's okay. Into the deepest depths of this I world. think she looks like Mel Mel Melania. Melania, yeah, 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 yeah. Like a cross between Melania and the Black Wolf. Yeah. No, they, they really copied Melania here, didn't they? Yeah, they, they did. did. Yeah. They really they did copy Melania. Yeah, yeah in, that, black... in Marrakech's... In Marrakech's um, Mar is it Markev or Marrakech? Yeah. One of the two. No, nah, Lord of the Fallen! October 13th. Interesting. I like that. That's not too far. This year is Winter's looking solid, you know. Winter's looking. Winter's looking solid. I'm impressed. I'll be getting that one. I'll be getting that one. Nah, I'll be getting that one too. That's a nice adventure game. 